Hi all. I'm going to hook up this cable. This one here is a display port. You can see on here it's square on this end. This one here is a regular HDMI plug. So this is one cable. It's got a display port plug on this side. That's the square side. And then this side is a regular HDMI plug. Okay. So we're going to use it on this computer here. Uh, the HDMI plug will go to the back of the monitor. That one. And then the display port goes to the back of the computer. So the display port is fairly new. I think it's only been out a few years. So uh, I thought this would be a good video because you might not have even noticed it on the back of your computer. Okay, and if you do see it, you might just think it's a HDMI plug. But uh, the HDMI plug, that one here, won't fit in the hole for the display port. Okay. So first, let's take a look at these plugs. Okay, so on the back of the computer, you can see right there is a display port, and you can see it's square on one end. Okay, and then on the back of the monitor, it's just a normal HDMI plug right there. Okay, so uh, here's the display port. It's the one on the square end, and uh, we'll go ahead and put that in here. Okay. And then the other end of the cable is the regular HDMI plug. Once you get these in, make sure you wiggle them around, and make sure they're nice and tight. Some of them actually have clamps that you press down on and push them in. Here's the display port plug. I'm just going to kind of push on it and wiggle it around and make sure it's in there. Uh, the reason for that is, I, I guess uh, some people are having trouble with their display port not working. And from what I've read, most of it is just because the plug isn't pushed in the whole way. You know, it's a small, small little holes in the connections, so it just needs to be inserted fully. Uh, if it's not working correctly, you'll get a picture on the screen that says no signal. I read other comments. They say you got to go in and change drivers, display drivers, and things like that. So, uh, my experience is this computer here on this side, when I hooked it up, it worked right away. You know, it's a Windows Server 2019 trial, brand new monitor. Uh, this one here, I really fought with it. It's a i7 computer, older one, it's about 10 years old or so, but it had Windows Server 2016 trial. And I couldn't get it to display a picture. Uh, I guess what they say to do is turn off the monitor, pull out your display port, plug it back in, you know, turn the computer back on, you know. And uh, I did that many times and it didn't work. I finally installed 
Windows Server 2019 trial on this one and made sure my plug was pushed in the whole way and it worked. I haven't had no problems since then. So it was either the plug not being pushed in fully or maybe uh, something built into the old operating systems it doesn't quite work right off the bat and that's where installing new drivers would come into play okay so uh, my main point is make sure your plug is pushed in the whole way uh, I read one comment that said like 99% of times the plugs not pushed in the whole way okay see ya